Hey, this is Kavita Nair. I'm a developer at Foz Asia, and now I'm going to tell about my GSOC project. I've worked for Loclock apps and Loclock server, and uh, I've added a few apps in Loclock apps page. You can search app by typing my name. So first, let me tell you about Emoji Heat Mapper app. When you click on the app, it gives you the details of the app, that is how to use it and all. So let's try this app now. So here you can see that there are two buttons here one is emoji map and other one is emoji heat map so first let me show you emoji heat map here you have a search query drop down so when you select an emoji and give a search you can see few marks on the map so in the similar way this emoji he emoji map when you give in search query it also displays the occurrence of emoji in twitter tweets and also the sentiment data of the emoji so as you see, as you can see in the map and the sentiment of emoji is joy Few other apps which I worked on are emoji heat map. So here we need not give any search query. Instead, all the emoji occurrences from the tweets are tracked and showed on the map. That is displayed on the map as heat map. My next app is compare Twitter profile app and also Twitter followers insight app. As you can see here in the PPT, uh, for search query we have to give two queries that are usernames of the Twitter profiles and give compare button. So it gives the comparison of two profiles in a tabular format. In the Twitter followers insight app, when you give a username as query, it gives two pie charts that is followers and following. As you can see in this screenshot followers and following and it is aggregated according to the uh, country they stay in and it also displays the followers and following list which are in clickable format and I've also worked on one click deployment buttons initially the one click deploy one click deployment buttons that is Heroku, Scalingo, Bluemix and Docker Cloud were uh, based on and build. So since Loclock server are changed to Gradle build, I had to change them to Gradle build. And I've also added a new button that is Azure one click button, which can create cloud instance on Azure one click, Azure cloud. So this is the Loclock server repo. Here you can see the one click deployment buttons. When you click on deploy to Azure, we are taken to this window that is deploy to Azure window where the default values are given already given. We just have to follow the next button. And then click on deploy. Our app gets deployed and we get a public IP address to which we can access our Loclock server. So here when you click on manage your resources, this is the public IP. We can run the public IP here. So the cloud instance of Loclock server in, on Azure. You can also contribute to us on Loclock apps. This is our uh, GitHub repository. You can join on our main mailing list or uh, Gitter chat. Thank you.